A head-to-head -head confrontation we can, quite simply, never get enough of. Talk about high profile, this qualifies and then some. Stay with us for complete coverage from the Emirates Stadium. Arsenal against Liverpool. Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal taking on Liverpool. Well, the atmosphere is building nicely here and we've got two teams who like to play good football. Let's hope we get a good game here. It should be. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. William Saliba starts alongside Gabriel in central defence. Gabriel Martinelli plays with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Trent Alexander-Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Mohamed Salah plays with Luis Diaz out wide. And leading the line today is Diogo Jota. And they kick off here. Trossard and cutting inside but timely defending when it mattered chance for Liverpool to use width to good effect so Bosloy and passing it through and a goal an early boost for them, the first goal of the game, they're off and running. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing, what a goal. Arsenal restart the game then, and they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal. Trossard. This looks promising, and couldn't quite square the game. Close. Well, it's certainly a decent effort, but not quite good enough. They still trail here. Diogo Jota. Oh, nice ball. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Declan Rice. Ben White. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. A fine reading of the situation. And a Liverpool throw in forthcoming. McAllister. And this is Diogo Jota now. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Bukayo Saka. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw.
Virgil van Dijk. So Bosloy. And this is Diogo Jota now. Can they take advantage? Having to shoot. It could be up for grabs. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, could that save by Raya be the turning point in this game? There's still only one goal behind here. The high press was on. Opportunity here. And foiled by Van Dijk. Trossard. And this is Diogo Jota now. And taken away from Salah. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play. So a throw in to come. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Declan Rice. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned here at the Emirates. Really enjoyed watching Luis Diaz go about his business in the first half. What have you made of his performance up to this point? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. So into the second half, Liverpool in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this is over. Gabriel Martinelli. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Good idea. Is there a way back for the opposition now? Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. And what an emphatic strike it is from Salah. Hit with his laces. It's a great finish and a great goal. underway with the lead standing at 2-0 Trossard Gabriel Martinelli now in possession Trossard Arsenal pushing forward with options available Arsenal a bit wasteful in possession Mo Salah the referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool that is how to keep it out of the net so a half an hour remaining. Havertz. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Well, he's certainly not alone. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Not going to go down as the prettiest passing sequence we've ever seen. Saka. Good distribution. Now the attack fizzled out. Diaz angled for Salah and well, nothing comes of it no way through
Gabriel Martinelli. Nice weight on the pass. And passing it well. Saka. An Arsenal corner. So making the substitution now. And over comes the corner. Clearance needed to be better. Clears it away. And a throw in for Liverpool. Luis Diaz, the final whistle, and the Gunners go down. They've lost this game, no points picked up. What did you think of it? Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team, and they didn't deserve anything from the game. They need a much better display next time out. So, positivity envelops Mo Salah, not for the first time either. Your verdict? Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.